Hello, my name is Andy Johnson. I'm at Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. Today I'd like to sh show you our new 2012 Heritage Glen 346 Q Bud. We'll just start right here. Right here we got a battery box. We put a new battery in it for you the day you pick it up. Right here you got a nice big power awning, nice big awning. The thing I want to point out is right at the corner of the awning, you got a downspout. Gives the water a place to go, gets away from your camper, keeps your camper clean. Right here you've got nice storage, it's all finished off inside so you don't have any exposed studs and you've got lighting in there too. Okay, another thing I wanted to show you is you've got a keyless entry right on your door uh, to unlock it and lock it for you. You've got the three steps. One thing I did want to point out is this camper weighs 9,800 pounds dry. You've got the nice uh, big grab handle right there. Nice feature you have right here is you TV that you can watch on the inside and the outside. So we just turned it so we can watch it from out here underneath our awning. Real nice feature to have. Okay, and you can also, you've got a cable out here and you've got uh, 110 power, so if you want to have a big TV out here, you can do that as well. Outside speakers right above the windows. They're nice down low so you don't have to turn them up a ton. Next cool feature we have for the family is you've got the bathroom, you've got door access right to it, you've got a porcelain toilet right there. Okay, now everybody's favorite right here is you got the outside kitchen. So you've got uh, you got your refrigerator right here, so you can get right to pop. You don't have to go in the camper. Nice storage. You've got uh, hot and cold water right here. Right here, before I miss it, is you got your power jack button right here, so you can push a button and your jacks go down. There's a gas grill that mounts right on the back here, and then you've got plenty of storage up here. My family would do all their cooking right here. More storage right there. Okay, as we come around the back, we've got the grill obviously. We've got the spare tire in the cover. Nice big window there for the kids. Then you got the big slide for the kids here. We'll show you that in a few seconds on the inside. It's like a full wall slide on this. The slides keep going. Okay, then you've got your power cord connection right here. Your water heater is right here. Here's the back side of that storage, and here's something I want to show you. Okay, so right here we've got hot and cold water, so you've got an outside shower right there. You've got a light right here. You've got your black tank flush right there, so you can hook up a hose and clean out your black tank. And then you've got all your hookups right here. So a real nice feature, nice to have it all together. Two 30-pound propane tanks right here. We fill those up the day you pick it up. And then those, there's those gutters again, doing its job, keeping your camper clean. And then we've got the nice aerodynamic front cap. One of the most aerodynamic caps I've seen. And then you've got the extended hitch pin. And it's all carved out for your short box truck as well. Now what we'll do is we'll get inside. Okay, if the kids are watching, we'll do their room first. One thing I want to start with over here is we've got a nice big bed, nice wide bed. Also, it's got the ladder right there for the kids so they can get up into it. We've got ducted air for the kids so when the doors are closed, they've got air conditioning. Storage is important for kids. They've got lots of toys, lots of clothes, and so we've got plenty of storage right here. The kids can have a TV right here, hook up their gaming, and then they've got all the storage right here. Full extension doors, metal door glides. Okay, now in this slide, we got a single up here, a double down below. Everybody's got a light. And one thing I want to show you is on the 4th of July, when you get more kids running with your family, this pulls out for another bed as well. So you can sleep a ton of people in this room. And the really big benefit is we've got a door. Okay, now we'll just start with the table. Really big U-shaped table. You can play cards around this table, feed the whole family around it, and storage is very important. Both of these pull out for storage. This table comes right out so you can use that as another couch. And this has got an Arizona room feature, so you got sunlights over the couch and over the table. Real nice feature, brightens it up a lot. Nice big windows. You got the couch. This couch has got an air bed in it, and so it sleeps one there, so you can sleep a ton of people here. Okay, now let's hit this storage right here. One of the biggest pantries on the lot right here. Huge pantry right there. Okay, we'll keep going. Moving more now into the kitchen. Massive pantry above. 
uh, DVD player, MP3 player, AM, FM, stereo right there. Okay, now let's turn the TV around. Okay, so when you're inside, it's as easy as that. Flip the TV around, and you got your TV right in front of the couch where it should be. More storage below for movies and everything else. Okay, then you got the freezer and the fridge. It's nice to have that nice uh, wood uh, cover on it. Makes it look nice, goes right with the wood. And then you got the microwave right here, stainless microwave, stainless uh, vent right here, and then you got the oven with the stainless. And then you got a stainless steel sink, pull out faucet, real nice feature to have. And then obviously more and more storage. A little more storage I don't want to miss right here. One thing I like about Heritage Glen is they put dividers right in here for silverware already. Full extension. Okay. Now, real nice feature here is you've got a touch pad right here. Looks just like a little phone. And what you can do is you push a button on here, the slides will go out, push another button, the awnings go out, and push another button, the jacks go down. Real nice feature to have. Okay, now what we'll do is we'll keep heading this way. Okay, so we've got an all-in-one bathroom, so it's a private bathroom. Nice feature about that is then people can, uh, if someone's in the bathroom, they can still get to the bedroom. You've got the medicine cabinet, got a nice big glass shower enclosure, plenty of room, plenty of height. And then you've got a porcelain toilet right there. Nice to have two bathrooms. Okay, now let's get up to the bedroom. Plenty of ceiling height in here, nice feature to have. And let's open this up. Storage all the way across the front. And there is lighting up here. The other nice feature up here is clothes basket right here. Power over here. Nice drawers right here. Full extension with metal door glides. And then we've got the bed right here. Bed lifts up. And then we've got more storage under there. Plenty of storage under there all the way from one end to the other. And then there's a light, there's two lights above the bed and then there is a window right here that opens up. So you got cross ventilation from these two windows. Okay, one thing I did miss is the second bathroom. Let's just sneak right back there. So you got a porcelain toilet here. So the kids get their own bathroom, your company gets their own bathroom and you've got your own bathroom. So you've got a half bath here and then a full bath up front by the master bedroom. Well, that is our 2012 Heritage Glen 346 Q-Bud. I hope this video helped you. If you have any questions on this camper or any of our other inventory here at Bullion RV, please call me, Andy Johnson, at 218-391-ANDY. Thanks and have a great day.